Hi guys, this is Maria from Den of Imagination and today I have a really cool uh, commission with me a really big army uh, consisting of uh, lamenters, uh, flesh tearers and some grey knights that are actually grey, not silver Okay, uh, first let's start off with this tank which has like one of the most uh, cool magnetization I have seen, but first let's check out the free hands. If you are a patron on our site, you were able to see the free hand earlier because we uh, update uh, our uh, patrons of our really cool VIP uh, VIP work in progress. <laughs> Sorry, uh, WIP photos. So we really, really uh, uh, encourage you to join our Patreon. <laughs> Okay, but let's uh, talk about the commission. Really nice freehand, beautiful non-metallic uh, elements on here, and over here some really small cool freehands here also, and uh, here is a freehanded scroll. And now let's go to magnetization because this whole part of the tank you can just take out. This also, and here, <laughs> nice, even a little wrench over here is uh, non-metallic, this is so cute, I love those little designs, so we can take those out, and then we put those elements here, and of course the uh, you can change the weapon, I really like it. It's really cool, really useful if you are not sure what uh, what kind of weapon do you want to play with, so it's really nice. Okay, let's check out other models. Let's go here. And here we have some really cool big guys. And of course, magnetization also. You can take out his hand if you don't want to play with hammer and uh, put a sword. Nice. What I really like about those models is that the Grey Knights are actually grey. Usually they're painted uh, with uh, silver or just some kind of silver metallic, but here the main armor color is grey, which is really nice. And I really like this really light greyish uh, color. It looks good. And over here we have this guy, Lamenter's Dreadnought, and he also has some magnetization, so here is a one available weapon. Oops. And then we can change the second. There is a lot of magnetized parts, I won't <laughs> show all of you, but uh, uh, we, uh, if you want to, to check all of them, we have them in our gallery, so it's really nice. If you want, if you're not sure or want to uh, have an, uh, different options of uh, on your model to, to play with, you can always uh, you can always always uh, just ask us to to do the magnetization, and we will be happy to because it's always a a nice idea. And here is one of the dreadnoughts in the flesh tears colors. Uh, the red is amazing. Like this is one of the coolest uh, red color schemes I've seen in my career as a <laughs> as a miniature painter. I real uh, painter. I really like you know this gradient here. It looks just really nice, and it's like a rich, rich, like almost uh, like a cherry colored thing. It's really nice. And over here we have. Uh, Lamenter's uh, shoulder pad and let's go to singles because they are something check out this guy really nice sword really nice non-metallics I like this bluish uh, tint on the metallics because uh, you know they are grey, so it's nice that the non-metallics are a little bit different. Here. 
he is also really cute check out the three-handed uh, three-handed sword and this guy this battle damages over here they are like something different and those necrons I are trying to get him but I don't think they will succeed <laughs> really beautiful model also and here is apothecary really beautiful blood effect on the base nice and here are some flesh cures singles also the red is just like wow other level i love those colors over here yeah and the cape the cape is just so beautiful and here are, uh, is our other hero check out this uh, OSL effect on the uh, on the skull on the cloth nice yeah uh, we also have a big uh, army of uh, Grey Knights like I will show you two uh, examples really cool as I said I really like this uh, greyish armor and some more lamenters I will pick two of them beautifully painted I like I really like those uh, those really neat uh, battle damage effects because they are just like mm, really neat really crispy really adds to the model and i love it and check out this little like uh, weathering on the on his uh, foot nice and i will show you one more thing also really nice and i will show you more singles from this uh, from this commission because they are all looking so good And those three-handed scrolls, mm -hmm. beautiful, beautiful. It has even like little paintings on it. It's really beautifully painted commission. Uh, I'm so impressed with the final effect. Uh, it was a really fun thing to watch to uh, to watch this uh, commission come to life. So uh, thank you very much for watching. We invite you to our Patreon and uh, see you soon. Bye!
It is time, Evelina. <gasps> time for what? Time to subscribe to our channel.